All right, and uh, some other characters here that I think are pretty good. We could try the mage. Uh, it certainly seems to be the best elemental based character. Uh, there aren't many actually. There aren't many characters that are like built for elemental, but absolutely this seems to be the best one. And it's really a character that doesn't technically really have any downsides, as long as you're planning on going purely elemental, which I am. Uh, so basically you get you know, a pretty big uh, boost on elemental damage, and then you start with two really good items for it. You know, I think maybe a mistake I see people do often is to start Wand. It's just completely redundant with the fact that I'm already starting with a Scourge Sausage. So I think basically everything else on here makes more sense. The two best I would say would be Shiv and Taser. I personally like Taser just because it gives me a harvesting boost at the start and it um, it flex it allows me to eventually usually my plan with Tasers is I'll either go full Taser or I'll, I'll go full Taser to start with and then I'll just pick up whatever high tier elemental stuff is offered later as like a one off. And that could be anything here. It could be a wand. I do like a one high tier wand later for like long range hits. Um, it could be a shiv. It could be a uh, legendary item. Anything like that. But these tasers are going to be just fine given that we have a lot of elemental damage to start with. And we have them applying fire uh, a decent amount of the time. And then that fire also spreads. Even though you didn't see it there, because apparently, I, despite it being 25% chance, it's apparently like 2% chance for me, but sure. Uh, luck is okay. I'd rather roll once here for elemental damage if we can. Alright, we don't get it. I'm fine with some range. Tasers do like to have range. Okay, we definitely take that. Eventually, that eventually too. I'm, I'm down locking both of them. Actually, I don't know that Lumberjack is worth locking. I think we don't need to lock that. There we go, that's a much better lock. Definitely the taze, or the uh, snake and the scared sausage. Don't taze me, bro. Too late. Taking little hits, feel a little pain, feel like I'm alive. Uh, let's see, attack speed's like okay, we could do that. Uh, still look for tasers this round. Found them. Fire burn that one guy to death. Nice. It's a walk off home run. Take some luck. Elemental damage finally. Take those. Don't need no scar. Take a lemonade. Peaceful bees, pretty good though. That'll give me a little bit of harvesting right now but at no downside. Boom, baby. We take it. Do I even lock the lemonade? Do I need the lemonade? We could go one of two routes here. I mean, I could also just say screw it to consumables and go the alien worm route. Just get regen. Or I could just take none of the above because I don't really need any of them. Fertilizer is much better. Now the taser zap does count as a projectile. As you level up the taser, you will shoot more projectiles out, but also it could be worth getting any sort of 
uh, Pierce related items such as the bullet or the bandana. I'm open to finding those. Take some Ellie damage, take some luck. Sharp bullet, I take it. Absolutely. Absolutely, I take it. Uh, we could take a weird ghost here. I think that's fine. I think that's fine. Gentle alien will be worth it. Uh, don't really need the shiv right now. I'm fine locking a barrel. Let's just go with that. Make sure we don't uh, accidentally die to anything. Those are the things that we might accidentally die to. I need to turn this effect off. The uh, the blurring of the edges of the screen, the screen that's already way too small to see anything on. Yeah, I need to turn that effect off. You can just like... Uh, can't there be a better way to show me I'm damaged? Like, why not just have my character blink or something? I don't need, I don't need to lose vision of the already vision impaired bullshit, you know? All right, we finally have our sixth taser there. Only took seven years, uh, but that's fine. That is fine. Hey, I'll take it. That's the penance. Give me that purple taser, baby. got a lot of harvesting right now. Let's get more, I guess. Luck. Brass knuckles could be doable, but I don't I don't even think it's necessarily beating out uh, tasers. Our tasers are pretty alright right now. And again, I don't mind range on them. Alright, we take that. And I hey I I've said it before. I like baby gecko. You get to a certain point with this thing, and it's as good, but actually better, for about the same amount of price as the red artifact that just puts everything toward you that I can never remember the name of. Sit of something. Sit of something, I don't know, yeah, who knows. You know what I'm talking about, the one that gives you all the materials all the time. If I just get five geckos, I have 50 range to go along with it for about the same price. Maybe it costs like 50 materials more, but I'd pay 50 materials for 50 range. Damn it. Thought I could get to that in time. Oh wow, that hurt. That actually hurt. Gotta be careful. Shit. Stay the hell away from them. Fuck. Apparently we need some health. It is elemental damage, but I lose speed for it. I guess I take it for free. And I'm gonna regret taking this over the armor. Probably. Let's take the armor. I need some survivability. I mean, I'll take that stuff. I'll take that. My survivability continues to go down, though. Uh, this is kind of survivability. Should I take it? Sure. Take that. Alien Eye is eventually good, but not now when I have 22 health. A 
Oh, good thing I took the ghost. I, I'm like the only HP I've been able to find. The other option would have been that sna the snail or whatever. Not the snail, but whatever that other thing is. We're doing a pretty good amount of damage. So I think it's fine that we didn't take the elemental damage there. I mean, I'm taking... Yeah, these loot orders die almost immediately. Damn it. Need health, I need speed. That's what we need. Probably worth, I guess. That is health at the cost of range. I kind of am not in the luxury to not take this. Could take the armor here. I think we will. Guess we'll take that elemental damage. I don't know that we take another gentle alien. I'm not feeling like particularly powerful. I think I should though. I have piercing, so let's let's make use of it. Um, finding good stuff for other characters. That is always one downside of going elemental. There's not a whole lot of stuff for elemental. It often feels kind of like an afterthought, even more so than engineering, I would say. Even though I hate, I would rather play elemental than engineering personally, but there just doesn't happen to be that many elemental items. And honestly, a lot of the good items just sort of dump elemental damage, so... Like the duck, for example. So it's not even as good as it normally is. to find an opening, hopefully, to get in there and get those materials. It's gonna be tough. I might have blown my chance there. Here we go. Got him. You see how useful, though, the uh, piercing is. Like, you get a lot of extra kills from that. Mm, I guess I take it. I could take some percent damage. Man, we really do need to get some health though. But if it's gonna offer me purple, I'll take it. Let's try to get back. Well, we got armor on the law down at least. I wouldn't mind this. Nullifies the damage I just took, but it's another pierce. I think that's definitely worth it. Uh, this is okay for 25. And this is good. Normally this item sucks, but it's actually pretty good for us. So at least there's that. Pumpkin we take. Take another campfire. We got a lot of regen, just not actual health. Um, I do kind of need to get some actual health, but at some point. I don't know that I do, bait. I'm going to try it. Round after. Then it's elite following that. We're just going to be glass cannon for a bit here, I guess. I don't really like to go glass cannon, but I haven't had much of a choice, in my opinion. Uh, unless I really wanted to reroll a bunch and hope that HP was offered. You know, all I've ever really been offered is very low amounts of HP here and there. and It's like I'd rather just take the high amounts of other stuff it's giving me and hope that eventually I find HP. I also could have ditched dodge. Maybe I should have just done that. The only HP it really offered me was like one of the worst forms of it, which is that uh, 8 HP but minus dodge blue item. Looks like a potion of some sort. Don't remember the name of it. You know what I'm talking about. Is elemental. I lose harvesting. Take it though. There we go. Nine HP. We absolutely take that huge buff. 
one engineering for every elemental. I guess we could take this. I don't currently have anything that it does for me, but um, I could. Now, now I get a I get more items opened up that could be good for me. So just like the the little turrets that get offered here and there become pretty good for me. Of course, it probably will not offer me any now. Uh, I don't need the cute monkey, actually. I got 10 HP regen. Fuel tank, that's pretty good. I don't think I lock charcoal, and I don't think I take the alien magic. I could take me. You know, I am suffering for HP. I will take alien magic. So we got an elite next round, not this round. Quite a lot of hits to take those lampreys out. Make sure we get these materials. Oh, make sure we kill that too. Damn, I don't feels like I'm taking more damage than I should, because uh, I have a lot of armor, but yeah, for whatever it's, whatever it's worth, I'm taking big hits. I don't seem to be... This is also why, I don't know, it could have been a mistake that I put some points into HP regen, because even with 10 points into it, we really don't regen much. If you kind of watch the top left, it's very slow. Peacock into an elite. That is very iffy. That is very iffy. I don't know if we can do that. Not at the amount of health we have. That's HP. I, I think we can take it. We're running tasers, so... This theoretically should be fine. Ah, bait into an elite. I guess we do it. I guess we do it. HP or dodge? I'm gonna take dodge for now. We take that. Oh, definitely take eye surgery. Dynamite could get good, but I need to see some actual landmines before I'm taking that. Incendiary turret, we can take that. We technically have some stuff for it. Lock those. Uh, blood donation, so I'm... how much am I regening right now? I technically do offset the blood donation. So I guess I will take it. But, uh... Just have to make sure to go even harder on... oh man, it's like the hardest elite too, fuck. This might be... tough. the elite, I can tell you that. Time to pray. Looks like we made it. Shit fight though. I have a piggy bank, don't I? I've like not been doing anything with that. Horrible items. At least we got a recycling machine, I believe. I believe we have a recycling machine? I'll have to double check that actually. Armor. Yeah, we have one. It's got 84 so far. It's actually not as much as I thought it would have earned to me. Take that, that, that. 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 Uh, again, I need actual explosions to justify that. I do technically lose HP regen, but it, I don't care. This is so good. This is actually so good. Get a little bit of piggy bank value here, I guess.
so we'll also be on the I mean we'll also be on the lookout for hopefully another item other than these tasers you know if the tasers have done their job so far but and you know I can win with them I just it'd be easier to transition into some other something that gives us an option for long range clear otherwise I'm just only waiting for the enemies to get to me before I can kill them which again is probably fine given that we have so much piercing so maybe I just don't really need it but certainly if we never found any piercing uh, then we would want to be hardcore looking out for something else how many times are you gonna offer me that crap uh, armor, I guess. Rip and tear. Turret, I guess we take. Campfire, I guess we take. Our speed is pretty damn low. Pretty damn low. But, I don't know, is it even that good? For 89 bucks, is it even that good? I don't know. I guess we take it. Power generator, usually good, but I have, like, nothing. We're going to be taking too many hits for that to matter. I can take that. I can certainly take that. I can take all of this. Let's see, an elite on 14. Let's take the adrenaline before taser. I'll take this, too. I mean, it's helping me a little bit with the speed that I've lost. I guess we're facing all the worst elites. I guess I'd rather face this one than the alligator. So at least it's that. It's positive, I guess. And again, though, not, not even going to try to kill this elite. Also, a flamethrower, obviously, would be good. I didn't list flamethrower off, but a uh, flamethrower would be amazing. It always is. Flamethrower is borderline good even if you don't go elemental. It just sort of does damage no matter what. But especially with the amount of elemental damage we have, we'd be happy to have it. I do gain HP from materials, so I probably should go for that. Fuck, it's tough though. It's fucking tough. Alright, we get through it. Technically is okay for me. HP or armor? I think we're good on armor. Um, really need some dodge, if anything. I think I'm done losing damage for luck. Well, maybe not. I, I need to find, like, something. Um, gosh, is this actually the first time that Etsy's catch makes sense? I mean, I already have minus 8 speed. It still just is so shitty because HP regen just doesn't... It's okay, but like... Losing that much speed... I guess I have tasers. I mean, this is... If ever there were a time to take Etsy's couch, this would be it. But it... I don't know, it costs a lot. It, it only gives 5 HP. And... Sure, I would have minus... Uh, so I'd have 15 on 16... I'd have 46 regen. Well, when in, if ever there were a time to take it, let's take it. Torch, I would take a purple supplemental weapon here, but not Torch. Not one of the worst in the game. If it was a purple wand, I'd take it here. I'd, I'd ditch my low tier uh, taser and I would take it. Oh, that's a potato. I think I take this first, though. This should be worth it uh, from here on. It's, it's still only five waves worth of it, but that's five times 15. Or five times three, 15. You know what? It's actually not worth it. It's not worth it. Let's take that. Tree and another snake. I guess there's no limit on how many snakes you can get. All right, we are slow as shit, but we have 57 regen... 5 HP a second, so it's still only half of what lifesteal gets you in a good lifesteal build, though. You know, that's kind of why I'm like, eh. 
Not that high on HP regen, but we'll see. It's still at 5 HP a second, so good. I mean, it should be enough. Maybe I should take the uh, items that make me stand still now. I think I had the opportunity to with the dodge one. I probably should have just took that. Especially considering I heal when I dodge. I feel like the elite rounds need to be like the boss round where randomly there's just like no enemies in it. Give you a proper chance to just battle the elite, you know? And kill it. Get your advantage. really good. Don't really need more regen. What we need is some dodge, but 3% ain't good enough. I have 73 luck. What are you doing, luck? Like, what are you doing? Are you doing anything for me? It doesn't appear that you are doing anything for me. Okay, there we go. Finally, it only took 700 gold to get there. Uh, so might as well, right? Might as well take that. Take that always, no matter who you are. Take that, we would like some range, since we are basically just sitting ducks. Uh, take that. I don't think we need any more regen. The regen is what it is at this point. Elite on the next wave. I can buy all those, that's good enough for me. Where are you at, Lampreys? Oh, you did? See, Taser likes range. We're already seeing some benefits there. Maybe I actually just go super hard on range now. Technically gets me range, but at the cost of attack speed, I don't like it. A uh, second blood donation. Hmm. Probably not, honestly. I mean, I could, but probably not. Right range, let's do it. It's good for us. Uh, landmines. Hey, it's engineering. Sure. Wait. I'm so confused. Ah, oh, I just realized my folly. So, I because I actually have minus 100 on engineering, which is super fucking lame. But I guess I gotta give this guy some downsides. Because I have minus 100 on engineering, it actually... Didn't give me anything, so that was a hundred bucks wasted. Hundred fifty bucks wasted, whatever it was. Fine, I guess. Fine, I guess. Uh, I don't even think I take the candle. I can deal with whatever you throw at me, game. I take that though. I take that though. Uh, I take this though. Normally I wouldn't, but I take it. Okay, we did want that. Let's take it. Don't really need that taser. Alright, bring it. A slow moving death machine. Death ball of death. Good thing I bought that uh one damage turret. So <laughs> it's like real uh real good purchase there. Only took me five to ten waves to figure out my mistake. <laughs> But that's what's great about Mage, you can be an idiot like me and it won't matter because you're just frickin' unstoppable. 
And I would say I don't rank. It's I do think it's kind of S tier, but I don't think it's like S tier as S plus tier, shall we say, in the way that like Masochist and all those just sort of like unlosable characters are. Like I think you can technically lose with Mage a little easier than those. Uh. Damage is tempting, but uh, I think we really do need to just get... Uh, range is actually more useful. Boom, boom, and take that. Don't need any of that, I guess. Baby elephant, kind of unnecessary, honestly. Take that. Get some huge piggy bank value. We're fighting an elite. Totally remembered that. This could be tight. We're regenning pretty well here. I think we're okay. This is probably the time where Couch definitely made sense to be taken. We're doing pretty alright with his Couch. This guy's getting murked. Boom. Elite down. Along with everything else. And just think, I've spent about two to three hundred materials on stupid engineering stuff. And, uh, I could have three, I could have that into other stuff by now. Uh, this is not actually worth it to me. Attack speed? I'm fine with some attack speed. Take another one of them. I could take this, but I want purple or better, I feel. So I'm not going to settle for it. I'm owed more at 93. At 93. Now, normally I'd take a fin, but we'll just lean into our slow-moving build here. Why not? Again, I maybe maybe I even take that if it's purple, but you gotta give me a purple one, dog. Not settling for that. I'll take that though. I'll take it. Our range is now at 174. That's kind of cool. Take our. We actually, only had the starting sausage. Or I guess we had one more, so that's all right. Eh, shitty potion. I mean, it is kind of a sign. That it's at 190, 129. Even though I should probably just get the piggy bank value. I guess I'll buy you. I guess I'll buy you. Down by how to buy you. Da, 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 do. No, I don't really listen to that uh, band. But I do know that song. I do know that song. I believe that's what the lyrics are. You can quote me on that one. Now, if you go to this uh, concert, you can sing along. Thank me later. And bada by you. Another snake. There's a snake in my boot. Let's get max dodge, why don't we? Uh, into the elite, why not take a bait? Why not take the bait? Giant belt. Well, I'll take that. Okay, Lightning Shiv, you are almost good enough for me to add. And uh, I would, but I feel like I owe it to the tasers to finish with the tasers. You know what I'm saying? I do feel like I owe it to the tasers. 264 range. Sif's Rig. We don't need that. I already have it at home. I already have Sif's Rig at home. It's called... 
gecko times three. You've come too late. Tell you what, let's take a padding. Let's go. All right, elites. I have uh, nine minus thirty attack speed. Let's go. You ain't gonna do shit to me, boy. That range is huge. Look at the lightning bolts here. Half the screen of double piercing while I'm at it too. And uh, what is the regen? 85. 85 regen. And that, it, my friends, is why you go tasers instead of wands. Pretty good. Mage, I still maintain that it's S tier. Maybe just mid to minus S tier. Because it is still technically a little, ever so slightly, bit harder than the likes of like a Maxicist or a Speedy or a, uh, I don't know, Golem, maybe a Demon even. Although Demon does take a little bit of finesse. But yeah, what did we get there? I mean, it didn't fight didn't last that long, so not that much damage, not that much opportunity to deal out damage there, but that's fine. This thing, my crit was at 24, which is weird because I did 20,000 damage. It does the 10% of the current health. Yeah, that's fine. I love that we got our range up to 264. That's awesome. Etsy's, Esty's couch. You know, I better put that in the thumbnail. I'm not going to get too many opportunities to do that. Jeez, how many how many snakes did we end up? Way more than we needed, by the way. There was a certain point where we really didn't need that many snakes. Where the hell are they? Hello? Snakes? Is this thing covering them up? I'm not seeing it. Seriously, where are the snakes? Oh, tsh. stupid UI. So, just to show you, what's, this game really is not built for controller, which is weird. Because isn't this the type of game that should be played on a controller and not a keyboard? Like, do you want Carpal Tunnel? Do you want Carpal Tunnel? Play it on a keyboard, then. Uh, but yeah, the only way I can get to the snake is from this mutation. If I go down... Uh, now it will. Okay, never mind. This is really bad UI, actually. So it, it'll go down there from the mutation, it'll go down there from the gecko, it'll go down there from the wheelbarrow, but not the gentle alien and beyond. So for some reason, these three will go down there. Everything to the right just goes down there. And if I'm scrolled up and I'm going down on this side, it just won't show me the, uh, the, the snake. So if for whatever reason, some by some stroke of luck, if the dev is actually watching this, which I know they're not. First off, I love you. You made a great game. But also, what the fuck? Uh, fix that shit. That doesn't make any sense. Anyway, as always, thanks for watching, and until next time, peace.